Here's another anime that you guys have been mentioning in the community post. This is Heavenly Delusion. I'm a little bit behind, but let's catch up. What is this anime about? It's a bunch of kids in a tomato garden. Hmm, so far it's got like a very innocent premise. It's just a bunch of kids, but like... Look at the infrastructure around this place. Is this gonna be some kind of, uh, you know, like, Promise Neverland kind of shit? Where it's just a bunch of kids stuck in, like, a lab? If you fail the test, what happens? Do you die? Is it that kind of show? I mean, the, the school looks like a normal Japanese, you know, high school or middle school classroom. But there's a robot sensei. No, I, no, 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 no. They're setting us up to get baited. No, no, no. What? The fuck kind of fish is that? <laughs> a fish to catch other fish. Is this foreshadowing? What if we actually see a fish with hands like that later? Outside of the outside. Yeah? But the iPad thing just like blinked. What do you, what was that? Huh? Now, this is more... Okay. Post-apocalyptic world? And those kids are in some kind of lab? Separated from this place? Huh? So, something happened in Japan. Where nobody seems to exist other than these kids. And then there's these two who are outside of the outside. I don't know what that really means. Oh, awesome. We don't have to wipe our ass with fucking leaves. And then... And then there's kids. <laughs> <What the fuck? laughs> it could be worse, like. <laughs> but true. <laughs> hey, yo. I mean, the brother and sister. <laughs> what kind of show is this? You know, for this post apocalyptic world, they're quite cheerful. They're not really depressed. They're, they're, if anything, they're just playing everything off like a joke. But I think this is more of a coping mechanism, or if anything. Right? Because, like, you gotta survive. You might as well be in good spirits. Is it any good? Is it good? I mean, what did you expect? You just, like, cut grass and shit and put it in there. Dad, probably? Never mind. She has a boyfriend? Friend is someone I want to see. Are they still alive? Maybe. Your destination? Their brother and sister... He has a destination? She's not going there? I'm so confused. Change in scenery again from the skies this time. Ooh, bird's eye view. That bird does not look normal. What is that? Anteater bird looking thing? Are these what have been killing off the humans? Huh? So like, this isn't a zombie show. In daytime, they can aim around, like they can just like walk around without really fearing for their lives. But at nighttime, there was that bird looking creature. So only at nighttime, there's danger? Bro, are you serious? So they're... <laughs> two women? <laughs> Even better! <laughs> oh, wait, what? To heaven. Now, the show is called Heavenly Delusion. Oh, wait, we got it. What kind of... Is that an actual gun? What is that? Maybe it's just a lie. Maybe they're bluffing. Lawless generation. World ended before it even began. They were born into this apocalyptic world. But those people have already experienced it. Huh. <laughs> but they're bags. Can he fight? Maybe he can... Oh. Oh, he can fight. Oh. Okay. Wait. Are these kids also from the lab that happened to escape? That's why they're so trained like this? But in the school lab, they were just doing paper tests. I'm not sure if there's also physical training involved. Okay, it's an actual gun! No, it's better than a gun! Some kind of laser beam? Okay. It was not a bluff. It was not a bluff. That's even more hype. Heaven.
They keep mentioning heaven. Where is heaven? Is it the lab? Again, this heaven keeps being brought up. Like, it's not this abstract thing we call heaven that everybody knows. It's, it's gotta be like a, like a place, like a safe haven, if anything, where people have gathered and it's like humanity's last, I don't know, hope? I don't know. Tomatoes again? There was tomatoes in the uh, intro scene in the lab place. Four shots. Okay, okay, okay. Tomato heaven again. It's the intro scene. The school scene. Yeah, yeah, the tomatoes. And this place is so advanced. There's robots everywhere. And like the kids are, they're kids, you know. The two characters outside are also kids. They're probably not from here if you don't know about heaven. This place probably is heaven. His name is Tokyo. Oh, boyfriend, girlfriend. Oh, I feel bad for this kid. Don't want to play with them. You know, that was just a jump, but hold, wait, wait, he caught the ball after throwing it. So they're physically extremely gifted. Like, that, that feed, that, that was not normal. The outside of the outside. Outside. Outside of heaven. They don't know. They have no idea. They're sheltered. Outside this wall. <laughs> Beyond this wall. <laughs> Attack on Titan. So they're blissfully unaware. Like, whoever set this place up intentionally has sheltered these kids to grow up in an environment where they're unaware what's going on outside. Why? They want to train these kids for what exactly? Outside of the outside. Huh? Did I? What? Did I just miss an important dialogue there? Same as you. What? What? First adult, I think. First adult we've seen. So director. What kind of medicine is that? No, 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 no. We're good. Don't ask questions like this. Uh oh. Uh oh. I don't think this is a good question. She's taking it decently, but like, I feel like this is a taboo. I feel like these adults don't want these kids knowing anything. Uh -huh. Oh. Wait, what? She's not keeping a secret? <laughs> Ow. Oh, you can carry your bag for it. Piggyback too, please. <laughs> Could you imagine if she asked? No, he just physically really gifted. Like, the way that he fought was kind of crazy. Wait, they're calling each other brother and sister, but they're not aware of each other's age or like hold up. They're not blood related. So even though they're hanging out together, they're like partners. They're not actual blood related. Okay, okay. It's just like brother and sister is just like, they're just calling each other that. What's in your hand, lady? Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, that was a weapon, but you know, <laughs> it's farming stuff. I don't know. <laughs> Relax, lady. Inazaki Robin. Who is that? Is that your dad? Why do you want to find them? Doc? Oh, this is, there's so much of the plot that it's happened before this, you know? That's just so confusing, and obviously they're intentionally not letting us know stuff. They're slowly just like sprinkling little hints in here. But damn, I am really interested in this plot. Oh, we got a hot spring episode already? Wait, wait, <laughs> holy sh... What are these scars from? Those bird creatures? At night? I, I don't... There's not, there must be other, like, monsters too. I don't know. Damn, she's gotten, like, a... It was body... Oh. Is that normal? To kiss yourself in the mirror? Is this some next-level narcissism? Like... <laughs> what is this? <laughs> I'm so pretty. I can't get off to anything except myself. Is it that kind of deal? <laughs> she's, uh... She's acting very cool about this. <laughs> oh, monster. Okay. We're finally getting more about like at night. Monsters only at nighttime? Man eater. Oh? 
Like the bird. You know, the bird we saw earlier. Why is she grabbing the knife as soon as... We can kill it. Guns have no Don't worry, we got a laser gun. Don't worry. Kiru Beam. Kiru Beam? What is that? I'm more interested in why she went for the knife as soon as those kids mentioned that they knew monsters. Like... Hey, the meal. Lady. The meal. Oh, there goes our food, man. Hmm. This is an interesting point she's bringing up. Where are you from? Are, what, what? Huh? No incest. <laughs> no incest. <laughs> Thank you for letting us know. We're not actually brother and sister. They're not actually. Like. <laughs> Lady, thank you for mentioning that incest is dangerous, though. Oh, thank God. <laughs> you did it! Wait, no, no, no. Go back to the manhunter this year. Shit got so dark and then immediately we're back to this goofy joking phase. No, go back. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, come on. You don't mean... That's terrible. And, like, at night times, the monsters come around. Do they just not... I mean... What's wrong? Whoa, whoa, what's wrong? Is there something wrong with this girl? Huh? Did the lady feed them the stew? What was in the stew? What was in the stew? Hold up. I don't like this. No, what was in the cooking, dude? No, what was in the cooking? I think she's ready to go hunting, maybe. But who? Not the man. I'm so confused. She wouldn't kill the kids, right? I think she's just getting... She's just like arming herself to protect herself in case the manhunter shows up. That's the manhunter, right? The bird? Hello? So maybe the people at the school, this lab here, are training these kids to be able to fight these manhunters? I, I don't know. Maybe to protect the inner citizens against them? Oh! What? Go back! What? What is that? What is that cliffhanger? We were just about to get some action, man. This ep this series is so confusing. There's so many different things going on. Post-apocalyptic world. There's this sheltered heaven, apparently. Tomato heaven, where these kids are being raised. And then they don't know about the outside. And the adults, like, know about them. They don't want them to go outside. What are they training them for? To be, like, their bodyguards against them? So they're, like, training superhumans. So that they can fight those manhunters. And then the adults inside don't have to do anything. And then, and then there's a brother and a sister that's outside. What happened to them? Why is one of them so strong? Why is... Where did she get the key to being? What's what, what's up with the house owner at the end? Where did she got the gun? Is she, she, did she put anything in the food? I don't know. There's so many questions, but we'll find out in the next episode. But hey, if you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please subscribe and check out the other videos and playlists for even more content. Until next time, take care.